Good morning, Reefers. I'm Daniel. This is Coralus, and I'm sitting here on the floor with you guys today next to the 170 Peninsula. I finished the aquascaping, and the sump now needs a little tuna. So, and also, Griffin is visiting today. What's up, Griffin? You want to say hi, buddy? Eh, he's got his bone. He don't really care right now. But one of the things that's been bothering me for a while is the filtration on this tank, and I want to actually um, switch over and add a refugium in here. So I will talk about that skimmer and a few other things. So let's get right to it. What's up, Griffin? He's camera shy right now. All right, guys, I want to give a little talk on this rock work that we did because I'm so freaking happy with it. The two arches came out perfectly. They're just suspended there. And there's so much water flow going around this rock work that I am completely satisfied. So you can check it out now. I'm gonna move the corals around. I'm gonna glue a bunch on there so you'll get to see it later on, what it looks like. I have a few minor, minor adjustments just because I'm OCD and always have to change everything, but it's pretty awesome. And these two pieces are independent of each other. And when you see it from the top down, it is awesome. So I should stop the water so you guys can see it, but it's just wow. So I'll give you a better look on all that later. But, uh, what, do I, what do I want to talk about? We do have a big, big old bucket of Chado, and I am gonna be spreading this around all the tanks and trying to put in refugiums everywhere. There's so many copepods, brine shrimp, and mice, whatever's living in there. It's just a good deal. So, there's that. And we got this crazy, crazy gold torch right here. This Aussie gold. Um, I'm gonna have to show you some pictures of that, Gabriel. That thing is stunning beyond belief, and that just came in, so I will get better pictures of that later. And we got some cool anemones, there's some crazy, crazy ultra red, and without the filter, you really can't appreciate that thing. But, I just wanted, like, like you said, this is quick, fast updates, we got a lot going on. I got some special fish coming in here, I got two blue pygmy octopuses, that are octopi, whatever, whatever, um, that are coming in. And uh, Joey, the king of DIY, I just saw your new tank and gotta say, man, it's pretty cool. So this is our freshwater cylinder tank and it's got some driftwood in it and a couple different fish. But I actually, after seeing Joey's tank with the salt water, I'm like, oh man, I should put some eels in here. So I may switch this over to salt water. I do have a special banded eel coming in today along with those octopi. And I wanna show them to you guys later on. So this is just a quick, quick, three minute update um, and I will talk more about stuff later on so here's our guys what's up this is Bruce and then you got Frosty so Jack Frost and you got Bruce Lee and this is Patrick from Spongebob over here um, don't ask why he got that name but I will show you later on he likes to eat plastic plants so he can't tell the difference and we got this really cool underwater submarine with the camera so I don't know if you guys have ever played with one of these things, but we will be swimming this in the tank later on and getting some pictures of the corals and whatnot. So brr, 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 that thing's gonna be pretty cool and I'll be playing with that. So that's thanks to Jesse, our IT web designer guy. So we will let him know how cool that works later on. But as far as the other updates, I am now taking classes on my, I guess, diving so I can get my certification. I am taking the pad eye open water diver thing, so I will update you guys on that as well. Anyone interested in what I have to do, feel free. I will explain it to you um, if you ever want to get your certification. So there's that. Um, really cool little shrimp tank. I'll be putting this thing together uh, and moving some stuff around later on, but I'm absolutely in love with these little tanks. So these are the aqua tops and they come with a light, a filter, pretty much everything you need to get it going. And I love that. So we wanna make reefing fun and easy for everyone, fresh water, salt water, whatever it is, we want it to be here and um, make it easy for you. So that's one of the things I wanna talk about as well. I will re be rebranding kind of like the business and our YouTube channel. Now that I'm doing more and more servicing and installs, I have some really cool, interesting videos for you guys, and I literally have just been sitting on videos for months now because I'm so busy. Uh, a lot of things that I think you guys would find extremely interesting. 
So, with that being said, I am going to be um, doing some cool videos on customers' tanks and, and other things like that as well. So, some of the interesting things that I want to show off it is going to happen, hopefully. But, yeah, so these are just, like I said, our quick updates. Um, I am going to probably change the name of the channel. Instead of Coral Lust, I'll probably call it, like, Danny Visits Aquariums or something weird. I don't know. But... We'll figure that out in time. So here's our African lungfish hiding in here. And I'm tempted to put puffers in here, but then I like want to switch it over. So I'm like saltwater puffers with eels. What's going to happen? Uh, I do love your feedback and opinion, guys. So let me know what you think in the comments below. And maybe we'll switch this and put those big eels in here. Because they're just awesome at home. My um, eel's like a little puppy dog. But all right, I've said enough. That's my update for today. I will try to do another one later on, just with all the goodies that are coming in so you guys can see how cool those little blue pygmy octopus are. So I really want to um, keep them around and not sell them this time. I always end up selling them and I'm, I get disappointed, but I want to make them my pets. So that's why I got two. In case somebody wants one, I will keep one for myself. But there you guys go. As always, thanks for watching. Happy reefing. Stay tuned for the next one.